Hey there! Do you like using checklists on your Trello cards as much as I do? Well, there's a super simple way to copy a checklist from one card to another, and I'm excited to show you how to do it. I'm Anissa from Mama Goes Beyond, and this is a two-minute Trello tip. All right, let's do a quick review on adding a checklist to a card in the first place. If I want to add a checklist, I turn this card over, come over here to where it says checklist. If I like, I can give the checklist a title. In this case, I'm going to call it done. I'm going to add a single item here, which is my done box so that I can check it off that it's been completed. If I want another card that has this same checklist on it, one option is to copy the whole card. Uh, I can change the title of the card to something like Buy Lamp. And when I create this card, you'll see the new Buy Lamp card has the same checklist on the back, the Done box, and the box is unchecked. I also have another option for adding a checklist, though. Maybe I don't want to copy the whole card. My Daily D Digital Declutter card already has some other information on it, but it has this great checklist so that I can use this card as a habit tracker and check a box off every day. If I want that same checklist to appear on my Do Yoga Daily card, I can come over here again to where it says checklist, and instead of copying the whole card, I can just copy items from this Daily Digital Declutter card, which has this 31 days of the month checklist. That will add just my 31-day checklist to the card with all the boxes unchecked and ready to go. If you liked that bite-sized tip, it is part of a series, so make sure you check out the others in the group, and don't forget to like and subscribe so you'll know when there are more videos released.